Hi, I'm Doug at Defiant Technologies and we make portable gas chromatography equipment. And today I thought I'd give a demonstration of one of our systems. This is the Frog 5000 that we, uh, we manufacture and it will allow you to run uh, samples of chemical contaminants, things like uh, volatile organic compounds that you may find in air, water, or soil samples. To do air testing, there's an adapter that goes on the front of this that allows you to pull air samples in directly. If you're running soil samples, you can simply measure out one gram of soil, add it into the sparge bottle, load in five milliliters of water, and you can run uh, soil samples. But today we're gonna do a demo on water samples. And what I have here is some slightly contaminated water. And you know, you typically you'll be getting in a sample in this type of vial and you may want to turn it upside down and see there's no bubbles in it because if there's a bubble in there, all the VOCs, follow organic compounds, are going to want to collect up in that bubble. But as you see here, no bubbles, it's full of water. And this could be water from a monitoring well, it could be from ground surface water, it could be contaminated with a fuel type product, uh, maybe there was a leaky storage tank in the ground, or it could be somebody was dumping uh, some chlorinated solvent that they were using in dry cleaning or cleaning parts. But anyway, with this sort of system, you can take and run those samples in the field and get your results right away. So the first thing to do is we will load a sample into the sparge bottle right here. And it's a five milliliter syringe. This is a standard volume that's used in any sort of uh, you know, water testing. I mean, if you're sending a sample to an off-site lab, this is basically the same procedure that they're going to be using. So I'll take my water sample here and load it into the syringe. And then push it on up to five milliliters. So we'll load the sample up. We'll rotate this on over to run water, and then we'll bring the sparge bottle off. Now, if you're running the thing out in the field, you don't have to be hooked up to a computer. You can press the button right here, and it will start and give you the results right up on the display. But since uh, we're gonna make a little video here and show how it operates, I'm gonna just hit the start button right here. Okay, the system just completed the run, so I'm gonna go in here and open up the chromatogram that it created. And I'll come on down here and choose the one and I'll bring it on up here. And you see the blue stripes, that's where the different chemical compounds that it was calibrated for show up. So I'll integrate the thing real quick. You can auto integrate or you can do it by hand here. And if I come along here and grab that one and this one and then these and I'll say view report. And it'll pop up and give you a little report showing the chemicals and the concentrations on over here. So it's identified benzene at 31 parts per billion. Uh, here's toluene at 32, uh, ethyl benzene at 1.8, and uh, so on. So this is a typical fuel type product that you would get from uh, something that was contaminated with gasoline. This is the sort of results you can get on this system. And you can, you know, within 10 minutes, you'll have an answer in a field and you'll know how your cleanup is progressing and it can help you correct the job and fix it on the spot. I thank you for watching the video. Please go to our website at defiant-tech.com.